welcome fellow folders and we are here with a new video and we're going to unbox my new overly big cutting mat so first of all this wait there make sure that scissors right here from there this is the mat i have used since day one and i've had it ever since i needed to start to cut my own squares um, it's done me absolutely incredible every model you have seen me make so far has been cut on this the paper has been cut on this um, from small papers to large sheets so this is the one i have used the original but it, it was time to finally get a new one because it's getting old uh, there's a lot of marks from over the years um, we can still see the Ryujin that I, I cut around for the Halloween video um, and it's quite hard to see the, the lines because of the dark green and the black um, so it's quite difficult to see when you cut if you want to try and line things up so I have went for a completely different colour hopefully um, I really like it um, from, the, from all the pictures um, Everything looked super clear to read. So first of all, I'm going to get rid of this one. Uh, we should put this. Let's pop it down here. I'm still going to keep the old one in case I need to do uh, use it for whatever reason. And um, so first of all, we have an A0 double-sided cutting mat. Oh, I went for the brown and grey. Uh, that's what I forgot. I forgot which colour it was. So the A0, so it's absolutely massive, it's like 80 centimetres by 110 centimetres, so it's much bigger and the reason I went for this size was because so I can cut large squares um, by folding, I have a sheet on me, let me see, just to give you an example. So for the um, was it the method method three in my how to cut perfect square video, you would fold the diagonal and then the diagonal like that, and then you would line it up and then trim. But because of the size of the cutting mat I had, doing this on large squares was near impossible. So this will solve that problem. Um, and what someone said was you can measure from this point down and this point down and then a large ruler to cut. So I've got a completely new straight ruler that I can use for that method. Right, the unboxing, the brown and grey A doubles, A zero. Let's be very careful not to scratch it. Oh yeah, so it's got a bit of cardboard under that anyway, so that's pretty good. And then this side. anymore so let's see what this looks like I'm excited to see first thing I notice I can see the lines absolutely clearly and what's cool is this is double colored on each side so you have two different colors and what I was also nervous about when buying this uh, from Amazon um, a lot of the reviews said that theirs came rolled, so rolled up. Whereas it says on here, um, always store flat. So I was I'm pretty nervous if this came rolled up because if it did, I would send it back and try and order a new one. Hopefully that came flat. Oh wow. Oh wow. 
This is beautiful. Look at this. Let's get rid of this cardboard. Oh, it's quite heavy. Oh god, it almost fell. Practically the size of the whole table. In fact, it's the same width as the table, so that is really nice. I'm um, just going to undo this tape. I want to see what the other side is like. There's your double coloured side. One of where on earth I'm going to store this in my room. I need to find somewhere. And it's big enough to hold this flat as well. It's important that you keep your cutting mat as flat as possible. So either flat on the ground or um, up against something to hold it upright. Let me just fold these over. And it should be easier. There we go. This is so nice. It just feels so professional. Um, try and shoot from that as well. In fact, I'll take the camera off after. We can look at it a bit more. So we can clearly see the lines are super vibrant, really white. Again, this is going to really help when cutting squares. If I need to line up uh, right angles using this, if I can't use, if I can't, from using a ruler. And it's not that thick as well. Let's see how thick it is. So let's see the other side. Oh, that's stunning. That is stunning. Look at, look at that. Oh my god. Um, I'm just not going to say anything. I'm just going to stop and appreciate the quality of this mat. Oh, I, I am over the moon with this. Got your, your angles here as well. Oh, this is going to come in handy so much. Right, let's take this camera off. Oh, I was unscrewing the wrong one. New tripod, so there's lots of knobs to turn. Upside down, so you're not able to read that. But look at the size of this. Um, how am I going to get past here? I just love the the light colour on it as well. It's, I think it's going to suit it absolutely perfectly for cutting squares. And I could even use it for like a folding, um, like something to fold on, like a video wise. Like having the camera here and then doing whatever I'm doing here. I think that would be a pretty neat touch. But I am so happy. Um, that I have received this flat and this quality and I can't wait to use it and that is it thank you everyone for watching and um, see you on the next video